right? Yeah, that's right. We saw parents, activists, doctors, police, all with one purpose, to get answers on the issues that matter to them most. I don't think there's one easy solution. Parents, police with blue badges. I don't know where I stand, but I am very interested in these debates. And doctors in white coats, all engaged in an ongoing debate, school safety. I think school safety is at the forefront of every person's mind. Susan McClarty constantly wonders about the safety of her 16-year-old. Those wonders turn to words at a town hall at League Academy. You're representing every citizen in your area from where you are elected. And I think we have to consider solutions that address everyone and not just a few. The first question fired, should teachers carry in the classroom? I think our teachers have enough to do without trying to uh, be uh, sharpshooters. There are some common sense down the middle things that we can do. Arming teachers, even the words seem a little ridiculous but not so ridiculous when you're looking at what we have in our society right now. We want our children to feel safe when they come to school. School Board Secretary Linda Leventis Wells says safety. There's no more joking. There's no jokes anymore. Starts with cracking down on frequent school threats. Today, they're going to be punished severely. It's not just going to be a talk. Oh, it's OK. Don't do that again. Now, with everything that's happening, everything is taken very seriously. The talk won't cut it with this crowd. They want action over argument. I wish that we would not argue on the fringes, but come together in the middle. And I think that we would have a lot more success if we did. Well, the panel hosted by our very own Jeff Hart also touched on topics like affordable housing, transportation, as well as the future of Greenville Health System. Michael.